It is 6.09 right now. We want to go back to a story we were previously sharing with you about mushrooms, a drug long known for its appearance at raves and psychedelic trips, getting a new reputation. Yeah, there's now a push to study them to treat mental health disorders, and some of that research is happening right here at the Cleveland Clinic. We want to go back to our Elizabeth Van Mitri live in Air Tracker 5 above the clinic with how this is going to work. Elizabeth. Yeah, so this trial is going to last 52 weeks. Participants are either going to get a placebo or the cyphilibin given to them during that trial. Now, this is all taking place right here at the Cleveland Clinic, and this is where researchers will be able to see and monitor the impacts of those drugs and see how they can treat addiction, depression, and even mood disorders. Cyophilibin is the primary psychoactive compound in magic mushrooms. Now, this isn't the first time psychedelics have been used in psychiatry. In the 1950s and 60s, it was widely used in the United States. Cleveland Clinic is part of a 50-state trial of the drug. So far, things are looking promising. So uh, if, if these trials were successful and showed that this was um, an effective treatment and a safe treatment, um, then we potentially could see FDA approval of psilocybin uh, by 2026. And uh, similarly, uh, LSD is a little bit further behind in development, but uh, that would be um, uh, uh, you know, possibly like 2027. So, so far, all of the trials, they've been pretty small, but things are looking promising. And as we mentioned, and as he just mentioned, we could see these in use as far as, as new as in 2027. For News 5, I'm Elizabeth Van Mitri. back to you.